here's just a quick video on getting to the ELD in a 2007 Honda Fit. This will also apply to 2008 and it will be very similar in the other Honda Fits. Uh, first you take off this clamshell the top. Then what you need to do is make sure you have the uh, negative cable disconnected. You don't want to be messing around in your fuse box with power going to it. Um, the next step will be to undo these three connections. That's what these guys go to back here. They're going to be 8 millimeter. Undo those three. Then there's a clamshell that actually goes around the bottom to protect all the connections on the bottom. This is what that looks like. You can see that's the orientation of it. And in here there's only two clips really you need to get to. Um, you just pull out, pull out on this side. So basically you're doing, I'm trying to do this with one hand, you're doing this to get the bottom off. And then you'll you'll gradually peel that off. It'll be a little a little sticky towards the uh, towards this side here, but just work with it. It'll come off. Um, and then what I'm going to do, what I'm about to do, is take off, peel back some of that plastic, and disconnect the wire from the ELD, which is just this uh, little brown box here. And what I'm trying to do is just isolate it. This will disable it. I'll probably get a light on the dash. But I'm just confirming that this is the issue. Um, what I've been having is the battery light flashing on and off randomly. Um, it's very strange, but that's the only thing I can think. I already checked my grounds. Grounds are good. I cleaned my battery posts. So just uh, a little video for anyone in a similar situation trying to track down a weird issue with their battery light coming on and off. All right. So just so you can see, I just unplugged the ELD. I'm going to show you what I had to do to get to it. Um, it's not too bad. Uh, there's this plastic you have to peel back. This is the connector already out. But there's this plastic you have to peel back. Don't be too worried about it. It's definitely not going to go back on. Um, the adhesive is basically crap now. Um, so you don't have to be too gentle with it. And then this connector is the one that you're going to unplug. There's a bunch of grease you'll see and that's really just for to keep water out. Um, the wire colors are yeah you can kind of see it. <laughs> yellow, blue and red and I think that's black and white. I can't really see super well um, but you can't get it wrong if you look on the front and you see that brown box that's your ELD so you just go right behind that and unplug it. Like I said, this is probably going to throw a code, but that's fine. I'm just trying to see if the car continues to exhibit the uh, battery off and on, or battery light off and on symptoms. Um, in which case, if it goes away, I'm just going to replace the ELD. It's, it's like a $25 part. It's not worth screwing around with. So, yeah.